outside as well and I'll see if I can get some footage here. I'm just warming it up now. But it starts great. It, it got down to in the 40s there the other day and it bang fires right up 50 50 degrees Fahrenheit on the on the coolant temps. Man you'd think it was a hot summer day so I don't think compression's down or anything. It has me concerned though. I thought maybe it was an injector and it happened to be right around the time they switched to summer fuel. So, uh, anyway. Well guys, here we are back in the shop and just looking things over. Can't see anything that's obvious. Uh, like I said, check for boost leaks. And uh, whatnot. So, being I have to change the water pump and I wanted to do the fuel modulator, um, and to get the blower uh, intake off and to check that bottom turbo, you can see it's uh, awfully tight. So being I have to do that and repair this valve cover as well, the Bondo doesn't seem to work very well for that. I'll, um, I'm going to lift the cab, so I'll bring it in tomorrow morning and do that. I mean, it only takes me an hour to get the cab off, and then 
I've got everything at my uh, at my reach there, so it just makes the job a lot easier. It's uh, even to get that cover off the blower. I got so many air conditioning lines and everything in the way. It just it's a nightmare. So that's part and parcel of <laughs> stuffing one of these engines into a a super duty. I guess if you know. If you had to, yes, yeah, you can get rid of this degas bottle and then pull those hoses off and get to that. But being I have to do a number of things, I think I'm just going to lift the cab. And trying to figure out why we're rolling coal. Another thing I think could be a cause is the blower bypass. Uh, I'm not sure. It looks like that's not working. So it's supposed to bypass at uh, 10 psi, and I don't think it's working now. So I just hooked up the sensor for it, and um, I'll monitor on my way home and see if it's uh, what the air box pressure is. So when it gets to 16 PSI air box, the valve should open. Um, whether or not that'll cause it to roll coal, I don't know. Anyway, we'll see. Something's not right anyway. We'll find out. Well, on further inspection here, I don't see any uh, aluminum dust. So I'll, I'll run her home and see if there's anything. And then tomorrow I'll come back and figure out what it is. Well, thanks a lot for watching, subscribing, and commenting, guys. I'll uh, let you know what I find.